Hello and welcome to our Excel Financial Functions video powered by Alchemax. In this video, Les Allen will be taking a look at using the NPER, Number of Periods, function. Les is an international skills developer at Alchemax and has a passion for Microsoft Excel and business intelligence, having been in the industry for the past five years. We trust you will find this video very informative. Here's the NPER function. Now the NPER function is going to tell me how many periods it would take if I know how much I need to pay and I know my interest rate. So if I know that I can afford to pay maybe $500 into a savings account and I need to get to a future value, then it'll tell me how many months that will take to pay back that particular amount or to hit that particular savings target. Have a look at the syntaxing there. First thing again is the rate, that's pretty common all the way through these formulas. PMT, well that's the PMT function from previous, but now we're just giving that a straight value. We know how much we're going to be paying, or we can afford to pay. PV and FV, so your present value and your future value, plus you've got type. Again, FV and type are in square brackets, so we don't have to worry about them if we don't need to. Now. Got a tab here where we've got the NPER function already set up. Again, the same process. The first part of this formula is to work out my interest rate. Again, just for ease, I'm going to be working on an interest rate of monthly, sorry, monthly repayment schedules. Okay. So my interest rate is at six percent. I would need to convert that uh, by dividing it by twelve. So let's start off with that. So take my interest rate from cell C5, divide it by twelve. And there we go. I know the amount that I can pay per month. And you see that I've already prepped that value of $175 as a negative value, because this is money that I'm going to be paying out. So let's reference that $175. The loan amount, the present value. Now if I was using this, again, I could use this for a savings function, just exactly as we demonstrated for PMT. I could use it as a savings function by ignoring my present value and then referencing a future value. But for me, this is a loan repayment schedule, so I'm going to reference my loan amount of 10,000. Let's start building the formula. So there's NPER. Now I can start referencing the rate of 0.5%, which is my monthly interest rate, comma. Next parameter required is the PMT, the payment amount. I can afford to pay $175, and the present value is referenced in cell D10. Final reminder, FV and type, because they're in square brackets, optional. I don't have to include them in the formula at this time. So I've built my formula. Enter. It would take me 67 months to pay back a loan of $10,000, an original loan of $10,000, if the interest rate is 6%, and I could afford to pay $175. Now, how many months would it take me if I could afford to maybe put in, say, 250 rather than 175 So stretch the budget a little bit, and that's impressive. You can see that just by adding in another $75 a month, the formula is calculated that it'll take me 40, 45 months rather than 67. Okay, so 22 months saved over the lifetime of this loan if I can just pony up an extra $75 into this repayment schedule. So please think about practical applications for this in your personal or your work life. What business needs cash flow? All businesses need cash flow, so start checking how you're paying back your loans, how you're paying off particular debts, how you're paying off particular credit cards, and see that if you can adjust your payment schedule by including a little bit more, how quickly can you pay these sorts of things off. There are many, many applications that you can use for these particular forms in your own work or personal life. Thank you for joining us for this YouTube video. If you found it useful, please visit www.alchemex.com to find out more. You are also welcome to subscribe to get our free Excel or Alchemex tips and tricks delivered directly to your inbox for continued learning. 
You may also be interested in finding out more about Excel on Steroids, a specialized training program powered by Alchemex at www.alchemexacademy.com. The three advanced online workshops focus on key Excel functionality for business reporting and decision making, covering worksheets and formulae, data lists and macros, and pivot tables and pivot charts. Find out more at www.alchemex.com forward slash training courses dot ASPX. Please visit alchemex.com for more information about our BI software products and training courses. The BI community at alchemex.ning.com for access to videos, forums, and more. The BI blog or the Alchemex Online Training Academy. You can also follow us on Twitter or Facebook. Please subscribe to Alchemex videos on YouTube channel www.youtube.com forward slash user forward slash Alchemex video. For sales or support or any other information, please email info at alchemex.com. We hope we can assist you again soon to enhance your reporting skills. Have a great day.